Hey everybody, it's the end of April and it's been an unusual season. We've had a lot of cool fronts at night, uh, sometimes in the 30s and 40s, and then in the daytime it may be 80 degrees, taking a long time for the water to warm up. I think it's five or six degrees cooler uh, than it would have been like last year around this time. Uh, I have seen a lot of white bass and hybrids over one of my summer spots. It's a, it's a point, it's a main lake point. And uh, I kept seeing white bass scattered for the last month or so along this point. Uh, every once in a while I would see some hybrids as I did today. And uh, it just, nothing would pan out. I tried down rigging real slowly. I tried using some uh, cast baits, some slabbing. I've tried doing everything. They just would not bite. So I tried to do something a little bit different. Uh, I just went fishing with a guide, Bob Mandel, of Holding the Line Guide Service, and we used a lot of uh, live shad and even some cut shad and did really well catching hybrids. Uh, so I decided to give that a go here at Fort Phantom. Uh, and so far it's paid off. I've caught about six or seven hybrids and uh, one or two white bass. So doing much, much better than I have in previous trips. Uh, a lot of action here. Right now I'm anchored, spot locked on a point and it is uh it's paid off really well it's been pretty frequent action i've chummed the water a little bit with cut shad uh and the shad i caught were huge i mean they were seven or eight inch gizzard shad so uh, i figured i'd just try some cut shad for one i didn't catch but maybe uh, half a dozen of them so i wanted to make my bait go further so i'm starting to use just cut bait and uh, so far I've caught several hybrids. It's been a great trip. So uh, if you're not having any luck out there, this, you know, while the water temperature is pretty cool, give cut shad a try and see if that pays off for you. Enjoy the video. Just wanted to show you guys on the sonar what I'm seeing. A lot of fish going up and down. They're very attracted to this area. I have my fish thumper on and you can tell it's a point. This is a whole main lake point, but then it particularly makes another point right here. And I'm kind of right here on the uh, deeper edge to going up on that, uh, the top of the point there. But look at that, lots of fish. I'm chumming the water and thumping at the same time and it's really paying off today. 